Hi, this is Tutor Nick P, and this is Noun Phrase 391. Noun Phrase today is Monkey Bars and Jungle Gym. Uh, so if somebody wants a screenshot, do it right now. All right, now sometimes Monkey Bars and Jungle Gym could be used interchangeably, and sometimes not, so let me explain. Uh, monkey Bars are a set of rows or, uh, of bars usually found in playgrounds on which one can climb and hang on bars. It is also called a Jungle Gym. In American English, the term monkey bars can be used for the whole jungle gym. Okay. Uh, so here's where the difference comes in. In British English, they only call the part of a jungle gym in which you can hang from and swing from one bar to another monkey bars. So they only call that section of the jungle gym uh, monkey bars. Okay, let's continue. The first jungle gym was invented and patented in 1920 by a lawyer, Sebastian Hinton. The term monkey bars had started to appear around the 1930s due to a monkey's instinct and the climbing habits of monkeys which resembled chil children on the jungle gym. Okay, and we got five examples to show just how it's used. Here's the first one. Uh, she is very good at climbing on the monkey bars. Okay, number two, she fell from the monkey bars and broke her arm. Now, it could happen sometimes in these playgrounds. Number three, uh, we often went to the playground to play on the jungle gym. Okay. And number four, he was hanging from his knees on the monkey bars. Yeah, sometimes they put their knees up there and then they'll hang their whole body down and just the knees are the part that's holding them up there. And number five, um, he set up a jungle gym for his children to play on in his backyard. Maybe a father did this and maybe several children, you know, for, for his children, maybe some, some close friends that are, you know, nearby in the neighborhood. Anyway, I hope you got it. I hope it was clear. I hope it was informative. Thank you for your time. Bye-bye.